For today's video, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of my latest purchase, which as you can see by the title, is the Louis Vuitton Toiletry Pouch. So I got this as a birthday present to myself. Today's actually my birthday. I mean, by the time this video goes up, it's not going to be my birthday anymore, but today's my birthday. Um, I got it a few days ago, but I wanted to wait to open it up on camera. Um, I've never done like an unboxing video, but I'm very excited to open it and show you guys what it looks like. I know I haven't uploaded a video in a really long time. The last video I put up was our Dubai vlog, which was back in September. Um, this is not really like an update video of where I've been and stuff like that. Um, I'm just filming a video today because I'm excited about my purchase. I wanted to unbox it. I know this has been a very popular item lately, so I wanted to show you guys tell you about where I got it, details about it, all that good stuff. So I got this at the Louis Vuitton inside Neiman Marcus, inside the new Hudson Yards Mall that's on 34th Street or 30 something street in Manhattan. Um, prior to going to that location, I had called a couple of different locations and it was sold out everywhere. And I was looking at it on Poshmark and a lot of the comments on Poshmark was um, like very rare, hard to find and I was like, why is this so hard to find um i didn't even know it was so popular i just wanted it because i wanted a good size clutch like i want to invest in a nice clutch i don't really have like a nice purse to use when i go out i just bring my big like louis tote or my big ysl tote and it's way too big so i wanted to get like invest in a nice clutch i mean which technically this is not a clutch it's actually a toiletry pouch but I'm definitely not going to be using it for traveling for my toiletries. It's just too nice. So I got the 26 size, which is three different sizes. I think it's 9, 15, and then 26. And it goes by centimeters. So 26 centimeters, which equals to, I think, 10 inches. So then once I saw that it was so popular and it was sold out everywhere, I was like, why is this so popular? So I started looking like on Instagram. I would type in like on the tag, like Louis Vuitton toiletry pouch. And I saw all these vloggers were using it with the same intention as a clutch so i'm like oh it's fucking instagram famous now so that's why i sold out everywhere so this retails for 445 which i felt was reasonable for a louis clutch i'm gonna keep like doing it in quotes because it's not really a clutch it's a toiletry bag but in terms of a louis vuitton clutch i thought that was pretty reasonable um i was looking at other actual clutches from louis vuitton and it was like like six, seven, eight hundred dollars and up. So I thought four something for a clutch was pretty good. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and open it. I've been waiting, dying to open this. I got this only like it's only been two days, but I've been dying to open it. But today's my actual birthday, so it just feels right to open it now. So let's just open it up. Oh. saving the box might use this for like display purposes in my room oh my god yes imagine it had like a scratch or it was like dirty or something no i definitely inspected it before i got it oh, oh so nice and classy oh my god that leather smell that fresh leather smell so this is the clutch again not technically a clutch but i'm going to be using it as a clutch perfect size i feel like it's even kind of big for a clutch but it's it's gonna fit everything like wallet phone keys makeup like it's a perfect size for going out again i have like i have like old little clutches from like aldo and stuff but i wanted to invest in a nice clutch that i can wear with anything this is literally going to go with anything um and it's the classic i forgot what this is called the classic i think monogram print um for my tote i have let me bring it over so for my never full tote i have the other print which i forgot what this is called i think it's something with a d damier or damier or something um but I don't have anything from Louis Vuitton with this classic monogram tote, which it's like, it's classic, it's timeless, it like, it never goes out of style. It always looks like clean and sleek and chic. So it's 10 inches this way, which is nice and big. The inside is like clean, just leather nude on the inside, which I hope it doesn't get dirty in there. Let me see how it looks like. 
standing up, like holding it when I stand up. So yeah, I'll probably just hold it like this under my arm. I know I have a YSL t-shirt on, but it's a Louis video. So I'm going to see what actually fits in here. Like when I would typically go out, like let's see how much I can actually fit. I haven't like actually tried to fit stuff. I'm going to put my whole wallet with this is, this is a pretty big wallet. This is my YSL. I don't know what's called. It literally fits the whole thing. <laughs> I would put my keys, I would put probably my glasses, because if I'm drunk, I want to see where the hell I'm going, um, my pepper spray, I would just probably put like my lip glosses and stuff, so like my all my four nude glosses, and it literally fits all of that perfectly, still with more space, it's not like bulky, it's not like bulging out still is like I mean it's getting a little heavy obviously but fits everything perfectly I just hate going out and like having to stuff things in my pockets or I have to ask my boyfriend to hold my stuff or if I have to bring like my big tote like just having to like have it on my arm or like there's no hooks wherever we're at like it's just it's I just needed something this perfect size and I'm so happy about my purchase. I don't treat myself to a lot of nice things all the time. Like, you know, I buy myself things here and there, but designer things, like I haven't got myself something nice in a really long time. So I felt like it was time to treat myself. That's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this type of like unboxing video, then give it a thumbs up so I know what you guys wanna see more of and also comment down below. Um, I'll also leave my Instagram name at the bottom so you can guys can follow me on Instagram. And that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video.